Hi, this is Peter. Welcome to an impromptu serendipitous episode of Beyond the Cane Pole. Um, this horse fly here is still alive. Landed on one of the dogs, flew up, another dog tried to go after it, and then it landed on me and I caught it. So what I'm going to do is I've got my, this is just a crappy pole I had rigged up. I'm going to put him on this hook, about like one would do a cricket. There's a horse fly on my hook. He probably won't live long, but hopefully a fish will find him yummy enough where he won't have to live long. By the way, this rod is nine foot long, um, very lightweight. We bought it at I think it was Bass Pro, one of their clearance stores. I bought one for me and one for the wife. Mainly it's for reaching, you know, jigging up in almost trees and stuff. You reach out and drop your jig. Oh, come on, ducks. It is a pain to maneuver around the trees if you're trying to cast, being as long as it is. Go way, Duck. Thank you, Duck. In the middle? Mm-hmm. Fish has it. Put the anti reverse is off. I went to lift the bass. There we go. Whoop. <clears throat> Dropped off. All right. Any rate, need to get him back in the water. We'll probably let the wife bend over and get him. Uh, just today, I was driving my truck and I had my knee knee pop out of joint. So, but yeah, that's how quick you can go fishing. That's all you need to do is catch some bait. She's holding him. You want me to grab him? Got him. There we go. Got one of the little cookie cutter largemouth bass from the pond. And gone. All right, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, just thought I'd be really quick and entertaining with the um, wood fact I caught a horse fly. There's also grasshoppers running around the yard. I don't think I'm going to catch one today. <laughs>